at least does believe there is a God. At least did believe there is a God. At least did believe there is only one God. At least did believe there is only one Creator. At least know these things. But by knowing that, he rejected. But why are Muslim rejecting the prayer? Now the question comes up, he is being lazy. Because most of the time, Muslim does not pray or being not closeness to Allah or being lazy. But not that hardly any rare cases that Muslim could reject. I don't want to pray. I don't care if Allah's commandment. So he he's going to go to hell. Why? But God, like he's just making a claim that I'm a Muslim. That's what the Iblis did and the Shaitan did. Allah said, you believe me. You believe in everything. But yet, you're rejecting my commandment. So what's the difference between those persons who reject Allah's commandment? So the claim is nothing. I believe claimed, but he rejected the commandments of Allah. So the Muslim does the same thing. So in order for someone to be a kafir, living a life in a kufr, or somebody is a kafir, there's a, many, many conditions has to be met in to analyze and come to the total conclusion. Is he a kafir or he is living a life of a kufr? It's, there's only one who can judge that. It is only one Allah.